freak incident. Um, how has the flood affected your life? Um, well, it was eye-opening. I think um, I'd always been born and raised here. I heard about the 100-year flood and uh, how devastating, devastating it could be, but obviously uh, I had never experienced anything like that. What damage have you seen that really opened your eyes and stuff? Well, I think uh, just seeing, again, just, uh, you know, when you think of flood, you think a lot of water uh, going into a house. So you imagine a lot of just very wet, damp situations. Just to see the amount of uh, mud and, and large stones and things like that that ended up in people's houses, I think that was, uh, it's pretty scary to think that earth, that much earth can keep. No, no, no. I mean, uh, not even close. Uh, there were some big snowstorms here and there, uh, but but nothing like this. I mean, you know, for it, snow, some snowstorms, maybe just uh, some people got stuck in their house for a day, you know. But uh, no, uh, nothing like this. What does this mean for the environment? Well, that's tough to say. I mean, the environment, you know, these type of natural disasters are created by quote unquote nature. And so, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm not worried that these type of things actually destroy the environment. So, you know, I, I think this is the way floods, massive fires have happened long before humans ever around. <laughs> Oh wait, it's still going!